What's going on? James Bonadies here. In this video, I'm going to do a complete walkthrough and tutorial of Goal High Level. And maybe you've been living under a rock and you haven't heard of it, but most likely you have. But if you haven't, you want to definitely check out this video because it is a game changer. So before I get into the logistics and the walkthrough, what is Goal High Level? Essentially, Goal High Level is an everything tool. It's an everything tool that I use in my marketing agency and I use in my education company. I was able to remove active campaign or any email service, uh, call fire or any phone service. I was able to remove and not have to pay for grade.us that I was using for rep management. I was able to get rid of and not have to pay for click funnels. I was able to not have to pay for and get rid of job form. I was able to get rid of and not have to pay for schedule once or Calendly. I was able to get rid of and not have to pay for pipe drive. I was able to all right, this is getting exhausting. Well, let me finish with this. I didn't have to pay for ManyChat. Uh, there was a lot of things, as you can see, that I didn't have to, uh, no longer have to pay for it, in both my agency side and my education side. I think I was paying uh, about $3,800 a month in tools that now I'm paying $297 for the uh, unlimited plan and $497 for the SaaS plan, okay? So with that intro now done, Let's get into Go High Level and all of its features, okay? And this is the updated version, okay? This is the newest one out there. I went and looked, and most of the reviews of Go High Level are old, and so I wanted to start 2023 with a fresh update. So the first thing that I want to do is I'm going to log in to my white labeled version of Go High Level, okay? So, and as you can see here, I'm blurred out any... Uh, private information. Uh, we actually have this little feature up here where you can do protection mode uh, because YouTube will remove the video if I literally let even an email address show because I've already gotten, I think, six videos now taken down. So uh, I'm just going to be very careful about that. So this is your agency login, right? What is the agency login? Essentially, when you purchase Go High Level, right, you are going to have your initial login, which is your agency. And this is what it's called. Now, because this is a white labeled version, when you first buy Go High Level, it's not gonna look like this. Like I paid money for um, for certain things to show. I've paid money to have a different design than the out of the box design. But whatever it might be, this is what, uh, what it looks like, all right? So on the left side, you have your dashboard. Uh, you can configure something called SaaS mode. Uh, you have all your sub accounts. Cool thing is about account snapshots, like Go High Level will come with certain snapshots in here, as you can see, like attorney, auto dealer. And then you can see here it has uh, uh, our own snapshots because through the years, I've been running this business since 2014, and then I moved everything into here. I have a massive amount of my own snapshots that we give our student base, right? We get uh, yoga, electrician, garage door, divorce lawyers, dental campaigns, I'll, a whole slew of them. And then on the coaching side, I even have snapshots for coaches and consultants. So there is a lot here. But you don't need to pay attention to anything other than vertical snapshots because that's the only thing that you would get. Uh, the reselling is just like what you can resell. So you can resell like WordPress. You can resell uh, Yext for local businesses, okay? The marketplace is essentially go high level, then sells all this other stuff here, which I never really do. Um, so because I don't ever do it, I don't really know. I guess you can buy a bunch of stuff directly from them. But like I said, I haven't ever bought anything from here, okay? Um, your affiliate portal is just basically like, for example, if I say I'm going to drop a link down below in the comments, and if you purchase through my affiliate link, go high level, I will give you three bonuses, like certain, any snapshots that you want that I have. Uh, I can give you the design to this agency toolbox. You could change the logo. You can make it look nice and pretty. Uh, so I do that for anybody who purchases through our link. All you have to do is purchase through our link down below and you can message me on uh, Facebook, which I'll also have my Facebook um, Messenger link there, okay? And then I'll add it to, or I'll send it over to you, okay? Anyway, um, partners, don't really pay attention. University is just all about learning uh, high-level courses. And the cool thing is, is if you do purchase through our affiliate link, we have an entire, uh, we have an entire training portal that looks like this. I think I've mentioned this in other videos that I've done. Uh, but it looks all like this, right? So this is basically go high level training, bunch of videos, overviews, prerequisite, running your agency, lead gen, message marketing, rep management, core trainings, and higher end trainings, okay? So you would get access to this as well. 
Anyway, that's just another shameless plug. Uh, SaaS education is learn how to sell SaaS. Fast track. This is just all basically go. Like basically it's your agency login, okay, is basically go high level trying to sell you stuff. So it's not that important, all right? And then I built this client calculator, which is pretty cool to show our students for the agency around. You could kind of plan your entire year ahead, uh, but that's neither here nor there. The fun comes when you set up your first client, your first account, we call it the sub account. So I'm gonna go ahead and log into uh, one of my clients, my agency clients accounts, all right? And as you can see here, we have opportunities, we have pipeline, we have conversion rates, and you this kind of stuff can be edited, uh, but either way, I wanna show you and walk you through. So because this is, again, repeating myself, because this is a white labeled uh, go high level account, yours will look different, and I've had these things customized, okay? So on the dashboard, you essentially just have here, it gives you like a lead report. Um, I've connected my Facebook ads to this, my Google ads to this, my Google My Business to this, right? You could do all that in the integrations. I'll get to that in a second. Conversations, uh, this is all the conversations that my sales team has, all right? It's all in here. You can see everything that goes. You can see all the emails that were sent. You can see the outbound calls that were made, as you can see right there, or inbound calls. You can see um, the... Uh, text messages that get out if you have that in your automation. So everything you need, you would see here, all right? We used to have to use Ring Central to call out, right? And that was so expensive. It was like the first thing I'd love to get rid of. All right, then the calendars, right? So we're going to look at calendars. Obviously, it's kind of full. You have some no-shows, you have some show-ups, and that this is the calendar. So when I say to you that you don't need schedule once, this is why you don't need schedule once. You have your own calendar. Uh, you can look at the appointments. You can have calendar settings. And our and um, these are all the different cal calendars. We have a 15-minute call, coaching call, our tech concierge, right? And you can create these different calendars, send people to different links depending on what they want to do. Then uh, you have your contacts. So these are all the contacts that come in. Well, what do you mean they come in? Well, if I'm running, uh, let's say, an electrician campaign on, on Google Pay-Per-Click, and I have a, we call them the two page sites, landing page, thank you page. And there's a form on that site. Anybody who fills that form out will now go into here. Now, keep in mind, the beautiful thing about the unlimited plan is that if I have an electrician, I'm going to have a different sub account for that electrician. If I have a plumber, I'm going to have a different sub, sub account for that plumber. Uh, if I have a lawyer, if I have a dental implant, right? They're all going to have their own separate accounts and you toggle between those accounts right from here. All right. We call them the sub accounts. Sales pipeline, right? I was able to get rid of pipe drive. Pipe drive was expensive. <laughs> it was very expensive. So in our agency, like right now, I have six uh, six scheduled appointments for the future. Uh, this is looking back a pretty long way uh, since 2020. So you can see how many calls I've you know generated. Uh, the, oh wait, this is oh, and let me show you this too. You could even have different sales teams. So if you're running, let's say. Uh, let's say a coaching offer, right? I could have a sales team for email marketing. Maybe I'm selling that. I could have a sales team for my setter, right? Or a, a, a pipeline for my, my setter. I could have a pipeline for all my electricians or that, or all, all the people who need work done for the, the electrical, right? They can call, we can have it in the sales pipeline. Electrician probably wouldn't use this, but you get what I'm saying. If you're running an agency, if you're running an agency, this is awesome. Okay, again, this is your CRM. Everything is run through one area. Payments, I can collect payments. I could hook up Stripe. Uh, I could look at any orders if anybody bought anything, subscriptions, transactions, products, coupons. I can create tax settings and integrations, right? Uh, marketing. So I have, a, I think I have a, a one Facebook page, but let's say you're running uh, social media marketing. You could connect your client directly into here. You could run all their marketing. You could post anything that they want to post. You can send emails through campaigns and templates and trigger links. I don't want to teach about that. So in this tab, uh, we have automations and this is where the amazing things happen, right? So the automations is taking over kind of like an active campaign. I don't know, Aweber, if anybody still uses that, uh, what are other, some big ones, any, any email servicing, right? And so this is where all of the emails are automatically sent, our text messages are automatically sent, so on and so forth. So if I go into, I just wanna make sure that this is all being hidden. Uh, let's go into 
main email campaign. Okay. And so this goes on for a pretty long time. All right. Like 30 or 40 days. And so as we're running our business and leads are coming in, they're getting email, they're getting text messages, they're getting voicemail drops. And can you imagine what this would do for your agency, and your local business? Now, the fun part, let's go to sites. Um, let's go to, uh, let's find a local business one. Let's go into one of our agency. Uh, let's do, uh, let's go tier three is kind of our high, more higher net worth. Let's go pain management. Let's take a look at our pain management funnel. Uh, just so you guys can get an understanding. All right. So this, so we have actually, we run two different types of pain management funnels. Uh, this is one, this is actually our original one that, you know, it don't, it doesn't look that pretty, but it works like crazy. It's a survey funnel. Again, Jot form, don't need to use survey. Or back in the day, we used to teach our students to use Wufu. Uh, so not only has it benefited our agency, it's been, benefited over 7,000 of our students' agencies. Uh, so let me go back to uh, the new one that we had built for our student base. And so this would be the remake of that. So we have the old one, which still people run to this day on Facebook. And then the new one kind of looks here. And so what our students get is they have the ability to take kind of a, a done for you two page site, and then they can edit it to match theirs, right? It's kind of a plug and play situation. And that's why we love this uh, go high level because now when students come into our group and they learn the foundation, they can now plug and play and go start taking action, right? That is the, that success and results come from action. It doesn't come from anything else but action vehicle and action. All right. Uh, so that was an example of our pain management one, but I just really wanted to give you the example of sites. Uh, then you have our reputation. So reputation is we used to use grade.us. We don't have to use that anymore. You can, you can literally go into, um, you can literally go in here and you can see, you can, you can hook up Yext and get a bunch of different citations to their Google business profile. Uh, and then anything that comes in will be shown here. Uh, invites, reviews received, so we can actually uh, create a link, all right? And that's in another tab, but you can create a link that you can give to your business owner and say, hey, anybody who comes and buys something, send them this link to leave a review, all right? Then of course you have your, your reporting data, all right? You have all this beautiful stuff. Uh, you can create tasks that you want to get done, let's say a VA. And here, if you go down here, all the way in the bottom is settings. This is more of like agency settings. So you have business info. This is the sub account and all their info. Uh, company billing, so you could have their their card on file. You could have your your client's card on file for you know t if you want if you're going to bill them for text messages or all that good stuff, um, or you just have your card and you pay for that because it's such a minimal cost. All of our staff goes here. Okay, so the beautiful thing about this, I wonder if it's going to allow me to do this. It's going to show. Yeah. So let's say my staff. Uh, yeah, it's right here. So as you can see, like this staff member doesn't get access to everything. They don't get access to the membership sites, because you could also put your course in here. I don't. I still think it needs a lot of work. Uh, that's the one caveat. We still use Kajabi uh, for the course side. For the agency side, doesn't matter. It You can use it. Um, we have a couple students who actually use this for their clients. They put uh, the training videos of this in, right? And I'll show you where that is, uh, right in here. So if, if a client is using this, they have like a bunch of different training videos. So we don't let them see like web, the websites, Facebook reporting, attribution reporting. We just can toggle on and off what, what their permissions are. And there'll be a role of a user. Um, they have their own phone number, availability. Like when can they when can they take, let's say for the example, this one, when can they take calls? If it's just a VA and they're doing work with you, they, you don't need that. Uh, they're gonna connect their own calendar to it. All right, so let's say if they're a salesperson or something. And so that is a, another great feature, sales pipeline. This is where you set the pipelines up. Calendars, this is where you set the calendars up. Phone numbers, this is where you purchase your phone number. If you're international, uh, I think USA and Canada, it's really, really easy. UK, Australia, anything outside of that, um, you have to do something called, um, you, you basically need to have a business registration and an address proof. That's it. Upload it, and you'll get your phone number. All right, nothing too difficult. Here's your reputation management, where if you have your Google business profile connected, and I'll show you where that gets connected, uh, you can literally generate a link and send it to your client's customers, right? So let's say so one of your client's customer comes in, purchases something, 
we can set up in an automation uh, to send them a thank you email for shopping with us. Can you leave us a review? Here's the link. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. All right. Uh, here's a profile tab. So in the profile tab, this is just, you know, logo, first name. This is the client's information. Uh, and you can put all their availability in here, connect their calendar, yada, yada. This is kind of like an overview. Uh, custom fields is basically, I think I can show this. Custom fields is basically like, if you want to send an email that says, hey, um, business name. So it would be contact.company name, right? And then it, then you don't have to individually send emails. It's all auto. So uh, that could go into maybe, um, you know, your emails or on the bottom, uh, street, city, country, state, zip, right? On the bottom of, uh, of your emails with a signature of who you are, okay? So that those are uh, custom fields. Custom values is you can assign a value ahead of time that you then can use for automation in your automations, in your emails, in your text messages. Again, this is all preset for you. Uh, okay, so domains, njelectricianpro.com is my client. That's his email, or that's the email that I created for his business. Uh, this is where I connected a funnel, let's say, a two-page site. Um, because uh, actually a very common question I always get asked, maybe you're new to the agency world is, hey, if somebody already has a website, my client already has a website, how do I connect the domain here? Well, you wouldn't connect the same domain that they have to a website here, running pay traffic, pay-per-click, uh, pay for example. And so if their company name is N NJ Electric Pro, you can create njelectricianpro.com. You can create uh, New Jersey Elect electrical.com, right? I'm just thinking of anything. You could do the county, say countyelectricians.com. So you would just kind of use whatever um, fits well, okay? Uh, media is would be any media files that you want to put in here, and then you could use them for, let's say, social media or emails or wherever you might be. Uh, URL redirects, I don't use any, but it would be like if I wanted to, if they had a, uh, a domain that you wanted to redirect, you could do that, or you had a domain integrations. Again, this is this is kind of where everything is set up, right? I can connect a TikTok account, a Shopify account. I can connect, you know, uh, my Google calendars, which would be at, uh, at gmail.com, my Facebook or the company or client's Facebook page, uh, QuickBooks, you can connect to it, Stripe, yada, yada, yada. All right. Email services, SMTPs. So uh, how do I email, right? Hey, James, how do I, how does, how do I set up a client account and then email them from, let's say, a njelectricianpro.com. Well, you have your domain set up on your domains, and then you would connect that domain um, to the service that you're going to send emails from. All right. We use Mailgun on our education side. And then on our agency side, we always use G Suite. All right. G Suite's easy, free, doesn't cost much, uh, doesn't cost anything to begin. Depends how many emails you're going to send. Uh, and it's very, very, very simple. You just click add service, uh, you click Gmail and you eat your the email you want to log in with and the password, right? It's there's step by step instructions for that. Uh, conversation providers, nothing we use tags. Uh, if somebody opts into the electrician two page site, we'll tag them electric, right? Just so you know where they came. Well, we would probably tag them PPC electric. if They came in from the pay per click campaign. Uh, labs is nothing Audit logs is anything that you do just in case you mess something up. And companies nothing with that we use. And so that my friends, is the uh, latest version of Go High Level. They are always adding new things. So it, you almost need a new video every six months. But an, it, as an agency owner and as an education company, coach, consultant, whatever you want to call it, I haven't had to add to this. All the new things that they come out, I leave alone. Uh, the, everything I showed you in this video is everything that I run my education company with and my agency with. All right. I haven't had to change anything. It's beautiful. It doesn't work. It all works and it's one tool. That's it. That's all I got. So please like, subscribe. If you find this information useful, if I missed anything, comment down below. If you don't know how to do something, comment down below. If you have a question, comment down below. But by liking and subscribing and, th um, and leaving comments, it helps push this video out for anybody who might find it informative. All right. Appreciate your time. Talk soon and look for the next video that I'll be dropping. Bye-bye.